Welcome, everybody. Hi, everybody. Know, uh, where you're tuning in from, pop us a note in the chat box. We're excited. Oh, yeah, I gotta get the chat box up. I everybody's like that. Hey, everybody. coming on in. Doing great. Glad you guys joined us. And Lee, will you tell everybody again about the views that can be on? Yeah, so um, in the upper right hand corner, there's where it says view, you can click if you want to see gallery view or speaker view. And um, if you're on your phone, we'll be kind of going, I'll be going back and forth so you can see it all. So let's That's just great. Hi, everybody, Massachusetts. I'm in Massachusetts. I'm in Boston today. Hi, Miami. Hi, Kitty. Everyone's we got people kind of joining us. Andrew okay. Weissman. Hi, Andrew. Miami's in the building. I see you, Andrew. <laughs> Hi, Shondell. Kimmy, did you call Shand Shondell? Um, we talked on Facebook, but I haven't called her yet. I got, I'm calling, she's on the list. <laughs> perfect. Perfect. Hi, ladies. Kind of coming on in. Hello, everybody. Right. I'm trying to get us all. So, Aubrey. Hi. Okay. So let me see. Hi, guys. Hi, Aubrey. Adding panelists here. Let's see. Hmm. Let's see. I want to see if I can make this smaller so I can still see it. So how many people, Lee, do you see on your screen? Just so I can make sure I'm doing this right. Uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen 13 so far. How do you see 13 and I see 11? Oh, now I see. Hold on. Three, six, nine. 12. I see 12. Awesome. Yep. They're kind of, we're, we're kind of just letting everybody in. So perfect. Welcome everybody. Are you staying on speaker view or gallery? Me or yeah. Um, I'm going to kind of switch back and forth. So you can kind of switch back and forth throughout the broadcast if you'd like. And then I can see him down. Okay. So I'll let yeah. And I'll let Lee explain that to everybody again so you guys can see. So number one, first of all, welcome everybody. I'm so happy you guys joined us tonight. Are we live on Facebook already? We are. Okay, great. So I'm so happy everybody's joining us. We've got a lot of people coming on board and we'll give them some time to come in. Wow, we have a lot of people already. Um, I have to put my glasses on so I can see. That's what happens up close. <laughs> When you're on stage, you can see everything from afar, but when you're up close, I need glasses. Um, but I want to thank you guys. It's our second Monday doing this, right? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah. And which is so exciting. And I know some of your writing, we can't see and interact with you like other people. So we pick new people every week to interact with us uh, because this is a fun night that we get to spend together. Tonight is a five minute glam. And we get to interact with each other and we all are in this together. So everybody comes with no makeup and ready to go. So when Jackie sets her timer as she walks us through, we'll be done in five minutes. That seems so scary to me. But we're, <laughs> all, we're all in this together. Yeah. Um, you ladies who got chosen to be on with us. We're so excited to have you join with us. Thank you. Thank you. I love all of you. And, and here's the thing, guys. The, the thing is, is that we're here to enjoy and interact and share this information with everybody watching. I think we have more than 1,300 people registered tonight, which is great. And then next week, of course, we'll have another group that'll be on live, that'll be doing the demonstration live with us. And that makes the whole concept much more fun than if it were just me and Jackie and Lee and Lisa right. doing this. So um, it really does make it for a fun night, um, a nice break from everybody in your house, <laughs> and a little bit of me time, or at least for me, it does. So uh, if I'm the only, maybe I'm the only one who will be honest about it, but we all need a moment. <laughs> yeah. Uh, and, and I think, Lee, you agree, right? <laughs> Definitely agree. <laughs> all need a moment of girl, and, and some guys are on here too, but a girl night. Uh, for me specifically, so we can have a lot of fun. And um, Lee, I'm going to let you tell everybody about the gallery and speaker view again, yeah. just while everybody's on. Um, so if if you have the option on your computer, whatever you're on, if you're on your computer or your phone, in the upper right-hand corner, you'll, you'll click on view, and you can choose if you want to see it in panelist or speaker view. If you don't have that option, don't worry, because I will be going back and forth and we'll kind of control what you see. 
You can also view it on Facebook for another view if you want to do it that way. But I like it all here on Zoom because we're all kind of together and uh, you can kind of control how you do see it. Exactly. Right. Exactly. And so I think, um, and Lisa, did you want to add anything? Say hi to everybody. Yeah, I'm like multitasking, trying to add people as, uh, you know, our panelists to see some of their names are different on Zoom than on Facebook. But anyway, no, I'm <laughs> super excited. I think, you know, our goal of doing this is really to empower average women. So we sort of do our best to pick out some of you that are artists to join us. And tonight we have a lot of naturalists that are learning together. So we're just supposed to have fun, grab a cup of tea, glass of wine. Um, but we were chatting right before we went live and Lee was saying how, you know, her sales are already skyrocketing and she's scheduling so many virtual consultations. And um, so that's equally as important to us. You know, we want to be able to connect with all of you because you are the face of motives. Um, but we also want to empower you to feel like you can do this and you're learning a new skill and we're all still figuring out Zoom. And so we hope that you learn by participating and feel like you can also host your own events and do your own individual consults. So Thank you for joining us, those that are taking the time. We sort of surprise people that after they register, like, hey, do you want to be a VIP guest? And we're switching people up each week. So no one really has time to plan. So this is cool because we're all just like in the raw, you know what I mean? So it's yeah, good. And I think that's what makes it really work. The idea is this for you not to, because I called Jackie, I was like, <laughs> I never just go on without my own makeup. But last Monday we did it and this Monday we're doing it. Exactly. And we're in separate locations tonight. And so it's so interesting uh, to see, you know, that we're all in this together. The idea is, is you don't have to be a makeup artist to do motives. Right. And you certainly have people within your own organization that can do motives with you, that this is a good opportunity to invite them and get customers involved. Yeah. Um, one of the things for sure that we've seen is that, the, you know, just to give you an idea, the 28 day challenge for skin has taken off. There's so many people getting new customers um, seeing huge results with their skin. Um, Kitty, I don't know where you are. If you're here, you've been sharing so many great things with everybody. I'm really impressed. And I think it's such a, a, a great way to just get your customers really involved and to get new customers. So the idea behind these things is for us to learn, gain new customers and have a lot of fun, you know, right. and that's what we're doing. And, and I think it's, it's really working. And I see all types of people from everywhere. We've got people from Hawaii, Australia, of course, Kitty, all types of people from everywhere tonight. And I, I'm excited because Jackie Gomez, who's my absolute favorite makeup <laughs> artist um, and one that I use for all of my major events and whenever I can <laughs> um, is with us tonight and she's going to walk you through what my five minute glam is because if you joined us last week you may know that um, I always tell people people are like oh well everybody doesn't your makeup so you must know how to do it I don't because Jackie always tries to tell me let me show you how to do it so when I'm not with <laughs> you you can do it but I refuse to do that because I always want to tell JR I don't know how to do it and I can't do it myself so it, to me it's a luxury um, but the great news is, is that I am learning how to do it myself, which is so important when we can't be together. And I think it's great for you guys to learn and feel comfortable knowing that most people love a simple technique. Right. Most people love something that's easy and simple to do. That's not complicated. Um, and you know, it's, it's fun and easy and achievable for everybody. And so that's what tonight is about the five minute glam, my five, five minute glam. And she's going to put on a clock. Yeah, which seems scary for us, but we're going <laughs> to follow her steps and we're going to do a five minute glam. Don't worry if you mess up because we can all laugh. The, those of you who are online yes. with us and, and can interact with us, we're going to have a lot of fun um, doing this together. And those of you who are at home watching this, please do it with us. Even if we don't get to, we, we're seeing you, but you can't see us. At, I mean, you can see us, but we right. can't see, interact with everybody. We want to see those photos afterwards or before and afters because uh, we're going to be using a lot of those images. And I think this is a great content for the future for all of us and to share with people. So we're going to have a lot of good, a lot of fun tonight. You're going yes, to be we are. You're going to be easy <laughs> on us, Jackie. One last thing I think maybe we should touch on is the chat versus the Q&A. 
Um, so we do have Sarah Slusher, who's Market America tonight. Um, and she's gonna do her best to answer questions as you come in. Like if you're like, oh wait, I missed the shade of that blush. You can ask questions in the actual question box would be the best place for us to see. Um, you could do them in the chat, but sometimes we have a hard time keeping up with the chat. So if you have a really important question, we just wanted to encourage you to do that. But otherwise, please talk to each other, chat, have fun. Um, you know, we want you to do that. So great. And we want so, you to share your I'm super excited to to just do this because I know it sounds scary. And I have to tell you, I, I did practice it one time today and I was able to do it. And I said, you know what? We're going to do it together. It's going to be super fun. So I'm well, going to thing is, yeah. is you, you usually don't get any notice. Like I, I said last week, when Jackie comes <laughs> to my house, I'll usually tell her, like, we literally have five minutes and she'll be like, yeah. what are you talking about? Yeah. Like we have five minutes before I have to be out there. I have five minutes before I have a reporter coming. I have five minutes before I have to do an interview. Yeah. She'll yeah. Be like, what? So at well, least that, you that one time I walked into your apartment in the city and you were like, just do something quick, like six, five minutes works. And I was like, oh my God. <laughs> okay. <laughs> and now we've kind of gotten it down to a science. Exactly. But, um, but being that she's putting a timer on it tonight so we can see yes. what happens close we get and don't stress if we're not completely done at five minutes you'll see how close we are yeah um, I mean look it's about having fun if we're not done obviously practice makes perfect but like you know when I tell Lauren you know this is for this is fun one because for the everyday girl if you have to go out if you you're busy working you're doing a million things if you get practicing these five minutes you're gonna you're actually going to grow into the five minutes and complete your makeup Today's yeah. a challenge. It's going to be super fun. So I'm going to walk you through the products. We're going to start. Let's do the serum really quick before I do the timer. So if you guys have a, your skincare, so you could prep your skin, make sure you always you do prep before. And you, I always do needle free before I do makeup. So yeah. always, you know what I mean? So I always do it. So I get it in my skin because I don't want any wrinkles right. to come through. Right, and I, I like that you press it in, Lauren. I always, when you put it on, when you ask me for it, you always like press it in, and I think that's great because it's like you're plumbing. Yeah, I never rub. I never rub, as you know. Right. I always press everything, and I do that because, well, I don't need to pull gravity any further, so. Right, and a good tip is just, you know, massage your skin upwards just to get the blood flowing, your neck, everything, just press it in, get the circulation going, tap around your eyes, you have dark circles that works a lot and of course i always do the roller on, on lauren we have some cool it always pictures. does this always yes always because it and just gets the blood my flowing lip. yes and it plumps everything up beautifully so we're gonna we'll go ahead and we're gonna i'm gonna walk you through we're gonna do the elements palette and we're gonna use the color this is native so it's like the mauve, like gray color here. This is a yeah. beautiful color. Um, and Lauren, I know you told me earlier that you love to contour with this, but that's that's something you could show us later. <laughs> okay, <laughs> I will. I won't interrupt your five minutes. Um, and then we're gonna move on to the precision liner. So if you guys want to line it up, do the palette, do the precision liner. Um, then we're gonna jump into the mascara. Because the important thing about this is we need to, you need to prepare yourself always and always think about like, what am I going to do? How am I going to do it? And make sure you're organized. So when you have those five minutes, you know what products to use quickly. After the mascara, we're going to do the illuminating foundation with your blender. Then we're going to do the dual powder foundation. That's going to be great because it's going to set. <coughs> and we're going to move on to Hampton Socialite. That's going to be our bronzer. Then we're going to use the Rebel Rose blush. And we're going to do it very lightly. So when you put your brush on that, uh, your brush on the blush, <laughs> you have to be... Um, very light because it has a lot of pigmentation, okay? And then we're going to finish off the five minutes, guys, with the rosewood lipstick that 
I always use this color on you, Lauren. It's like a safe to go color, right? Great color. So are you guys ready? I'm so excited. Ready? Uh, do you have any questions before we start? We're just so doing it. Quickly, when we go into the eyeshadow, we're going to do it from, you could use the brush that comes in the palette, which is this one. And we're going to start from the lash line to the crease. Okay. And then we're going to move on to the precision liner and the mascara and everything else. So we're just going to go for it. Okay? So what other brushes are they going to use so they can have them ready? Is it just that brush? Yes. Or um, if you want to continue blending, you can use the Motives um, eyeshadow brush from the kit, from the from the brush roll. I have that. Yes, that one. Um, and that's it. You guys ready? For the shadow. That's for the shadow. Yes. And then the blush they can use. You got the other blush, uh, the blush. For the brush. blush. Okay, for the bronzer, we're going to do the contour one, which is this one. That's for the Hampton Socialite. I like to use this one for the dual foundation, the powder. We're going to buff that quickly all over. And then I'm going to go ahead and go back to the contour one and do the blush, which is very lightly. Okay. Yes. And if you have, I'll just say, if you have at the end, if you have time, <laughs> and they have their little brush like this, this is the, I can't remember if this is the lip or the, Liner. Oh, no, it's a lip. Oh, the lip liner, um, this, but it's so I'll I'll contour with this really fast at the end. Yeah. Oh, you know which one is good for that, Lauren? The this one, the crease one. No, it's you, good, but I like this one for my nose too. Oh, really? Oh, that's good. That's a good tip. <laughs> you know, I'm such a contour freak that I think it's important. Of course. All right. If okay. I have time, I'll do it. Okay. I want to see it. All right, guys, I have five minutes. I don't know if you can see it on my time here. Everybody, don't panic. Now, as uh, as we do it together, I'm going to walk you through it, okay? And I'm going to tell you how much time we have left. So <laughs> trust me, it's going to be fun. Ready? Ready. Grab your palette. Grab your brush. I want to see everyone's brush on hand. I feel like I'm gearing up for an extreme sport. Like... <laughs> Ready? I feel like we're in one of those like supermarket contests. I think okay. I'm gonna get yeah. all my brushes in my hand, like ready to go. All right. You ready? I'm starting the clock I'm now. They're ready with us. This is gonna be fun. Okay. Ready? Three, two, one, go. All right. So you're gonna so. show it to us. Okay, so we're gonna start from the lash line and we're gonna work our way up to the crease. Okay and just blend it back and forth on the crease. I'm gonna do the other eye now. And this is a great color because it dresses up the eye really quickly. And you're just gonna blend it. A little bit goes a long way, okay? I'm moving on to the precision liner, guys. Got it. We are going to quickly do the dot in the inner corner, the dot in the middle and the dot at the end. And we're gonna connect everything really, 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 really thinly next to the lash line. You don't need, it doesn't even need to be so thick or noticeable. It's really just to give you a shape, okay? So I'm doing the other eye now, and we have four minutes left. That's just been one minute pass. It's not fair, I can't even move. <laughs> okay. A good tip, I like to go underneath my waterline just to give the eye a little bit more intensity. Okay. All right, now we're moving on to mascara, my loves. You could do it. We're gonna do mascara. We're gonna do maybe one or two coats, I think works for each eye. Okay. I'm, I'm moving on to the other eye. I think we've only used 30 seconds. We have three minutes left. That's a long time. All right, guys, you all looking good. I see all of you. Now we're going to do the foundation. I have the sponge and I'm going in, guys. So you're just patting in 
I don't have concealer on my list, but I love this foundation because it's buildable. So if you see that I'm pressing on the color, okay, and just blend it all over with your sponge. We should get an extra minute to watch you and then do it. Okay. <laughs> yeah. <I'd be> great. <laughs> okay. I like it. So you're putting the foundation on. I should be done, but I'm just starting. It's okay. And this is the fun part. It's a challenge, but you know, Lauren, this is how I feel when you tell me you're giving me five minutes. <laughs> <laughs> I get it. She's like, I get you it. pleasure in this payback, you know. <laughs> this, is payback. this is like really I bad love now. you. Now I feel bad. President. No, it's fun. Listen, I work the best when I'm under pressure. Trust me, I tell Kim all the time. <laughs> Okay, my loves, I'm moving on to the do a pressed powder. I'm using my brush. I'm setting everything in circle motions. It's very light all over. Okay, we have one minute and a half. Oh my God. We're gonna do bronzer. I'm gonna do bronzer like a number three from the forehead down my brow bone. And on the other side. You are on, on the, I'm on the powder still. Yeah, I and I'm moving on to blush, smile, and circular motions. Who's with me? Let I'm me see. Foundation. Who's on blush? Who's on blush? Come on, guys. Five minute challenge. This is I'm fun. I'm on blush yet. Now, if, you I'm foundation. Blush, if you do a little too much blush, your foundation um, sponge is always your concealer, or it helps correct. Mm -hmm. Excuse me. That's and guess what? You have one minute left, and I'm on lips. Who's on lips? Let's go, Jackie. Dang, girl. <laughs> That's a lot of blush, Sally. Okay, you can, correct, you can correct the blush. If you have a little of the foundation, you just press it over it, and it, like, helps erase and dim everything out a bit. Is that better? All right, guys, we have 40 yeah. seconds. I am done. Who is done with me? Oh, so it's not all I have is blush. We're done? Oh, yeah, yeah. 30 seconds. I see you guys. I'm done. I'm done. Finn, Kim. I'm done. I'm done. I'm done. I'm done. I'm done. Lauren, you're looking good. You did your lips? I did. Oh, yeah. I'm done. <laughs> all right, guys, we have 16 seconds. You still have time. You could brush your eyebrows like I no. do. I have 16 seconds. I'm gonna take that second color in the elements palette and do a contour on my nose. Go, oh, you have five seconds. Woo! Look at that. I love it. That is amazing. Time's up. Not there. We did it. Woo! I didn't. Hands up, brushes down. Brushes down. <laughs> look at you, Sabrina. You look great. Hey, I'm learning from the best, so thank you. Listen, like I said, this is about having fun. This is about learning and understanding products and really falling in love with a great line who has, you know, the ex you have the accessibility to play and to create and to have challenges. Like when I did this today, my sister was like, I want to do it. I literally timed her. <laughs> Let Stephanie, me you should have set the clock back a minute for it. Because we next, next time we gotta watch. Next time I think we have to watch you do it and then okay. do it again with you. Yeah. Okay. You want me to we do it? Get to watch you while okay. we did it, but that's okay. We got it done. Okay. Give me still it doing it. I'm so proud of you. I see your liner and it looks so good. <laughs> <laughs> I'm telling you, I've been practicing. You know, I don't like to use liner normally. Yes. But practicing but you know the dots work because you just yeah. connect them you just do them really tiny to your lash line you connect and it's the Let easiest thing you guys wow kitty you yeah. look hot look at aubrey aubrey you put the hair down like me girl you're going in <laughs> well I, I didn't have to have a blow up but i really wanted one but everybody looks good lisa looks good lee you always look fabulous so Lola, you know what you look great and julie look at everybody maury and emily so now you could give yourself an extra five minutes and perfect, right? And you could do like underneath with the um, native color, like I do on you, Lauren. You could do yeah. underneath like there. a day to night, because that is very like what I do on the daily. Jackie, I know you were saying earlier about like when you've got like kids to feed and you're running yeah. around. It's like no one has time for that. 
Yeah, exactly. Hey, Lena, did you get a photo of this? This is such a good yeah. picture for social because we all look cute after five minutes. After five minutes. And you guys look beautiful. Like I could see you. I could see your eyeshadow. I could see your lips. I could see your blush. Um, and this, this color is, something... is so good for everybody's eyes too. Yeah. I love this, this color, color because this is actually, I did this color on you for the 25 year anniversary. And I, I love that those pictures, you look so gorgeous and I love how your <laughs> eyes look. And that's, that's the native color from this palette. Yeah. It's a great color for everybody. And if I had an extra minute, I might've taken the same shadow and went underneath the eye just a little bit. Right, right, but that's what I so, did. Exactly. It's so good for a fast five minutes. If you've got, got to get out of the house and you've got to do something fast, these are great colors. I think the Element palette is one of my favorite palettes still though, because if you notice like, um, and, and we'll talk about this in another Zoom call, but I'm a big, um, you guys know, highlight and contour girl. So I would use that first shadow and the one below it as a highlight yeah yeah let's do it yeah my skin life because i always think the more you sculpt the better your face looks so i'm not afraid of it in fact i am a big believer as jackie knows i'm not a big powder girl i don't like a lot of powder so right. i mostly skip that step here for me people said well that's crazy because you'll look oily no i like to call it a glow right 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 it's not oily I think that skin should be glowing and it can't glow if you can pick it up with a lot of powder. And exactly. so I like to use these colors and then I would take that bottom color right behind it, right below it. And I would put that just at the tip. So when the, when, if I were outside and the sun hit that, it would glow just a little bit. And, and I'm know, the type to take mm -hmm. that with my finger right down the center and make your, your nose look so much better. Wow. That looks so much better. Um, and you see this color here right next to the highlighter that's like that bronzy light color that's such a pretty color and just with your finger you could just pop it right in the middle of your shadow and it yeah. just makes such a beautiful difference like it gives you that really pretty glow but what we're doing right now is kind of going day to night five minutes to yeah there to you go <laughs> which is cool because that second color in the palette right here is the is the color i would use if i'm contouring my nose Right. Or if I want to do my cheeks really fast or underneath my um, my my forehead or at the bottom of my jaw. Or I always do like a dark contour right under here to make my lips look fuller. So exactly. I may put it right under here and I always do lighter on the corners. But um, and so I, I like this palette because, first of all, I'm a big matte girl. Right. So mm -hmm. this is the ultimate palette. If if you don't have this palette, you should get this palette. Hi, baby. <laughs> hi, <Carla. Say> hi. <laughs> and so this palette is great for everybody. If you don't have it, I recommend it because it is my go-to palette. It is my favorite palette. And I did forget, you know, Jackie, I should be using this color really more. But I like it because I will wet the black shadow and use it underneath. Right. And on top as a liner. Yeah. You and can smoke it out. Super simple. You can smoke it out. And the other thing you can do, and Jackie and I did this one year, is like, we'll actually take Vaseline on our, my lids and I'll put that black shadow right on top to make it a pat and mm -hmm. eye. Exactly. And it's so dressy. It just, it takes you so from dressy. day to night so quickly. I it love really, it. This it looks is a beautiful. palette for everybody. And this blush, I love how pigmented it is because a little bit goes a long way. Yeah, mm -hmm. exactly. You have it to looks just great. Tap it. That looks great on everybody's color color yeah. skin you know what i mean it's great so if your skin is darker it still looks beautiful this precision liner is so good mm -hmm. um it's, it's great. one of my favorites and it we is. all look look we all look uniform we look like a big old bridal party <laughs> i love it yeah, except i have eyeliner running up my eye in one spot <laughs> it's okay. okay you know what practice makes perfect five minutes it's something that not everybody's going to really think about and, and want to do, but now, you know, like we had this cool challenge. This is what you can do. Always prepare yourself. Think about the products that you're going to use. And then you could jump right in. Like we did it in order, super organized and right. you'll beat the time. You'll beat the time. And I know a lot of you in the chat on zoom are asking about these products and where to buy them. I just added the link in the chat. And I'm also going to do it on Facebook. So you guys have access to shop 
all the products we use today. And it's easy to share that link with any friends if you think this is the perfect look for them as well. Yes. So awesome. any questions from anybody? This was a fun five minute glam. I think, Super fun. Um, you know, one thing to note, and Lauren did a great job talking about that is, you know, there's no rules with makeup. So you can get really creative. And I think most women want like more bang for their buck. So giving them those little tips with multi-purpose uh, uses for the same palette, like there's no reason that you can't use the brown as a subtle contour or use the white matte shadow right. as a little bit of a highlight. So don't be afraid to do that. And like, there's so much value for your customer if you just take some time and show them, okay, here's what you do day to day, but here's how you jazz it up or, or give more. Yeah. Tips. And you know, at the end of the day, there's no rules with makeup. And that's why makeup is so amazing. You can have so much fun. You could use, like Lauren said, an eyeshadow to contour, um, you know, an eyeshadow to highlight a blush. You could even put a blush on your lips. I mean, I heard that tip from Talia, Lauren. Remember, she said she put the yeah. eyeshadow on her lip and then she popped yeah. a gloss. Mm -hmm. Like, yeah. And it's that's the beauty of makeup. It transforms you and you become creative. So have fun yeah. with it. Yeah, and this I've never actually <laughs> used the, the brown as a contour. And so that was kind of neat, actually, to do that with the palette. And see, so, that's great. I mean, that's like, that's like Christmas right there. That's very cool. I, know, I, I agree with you because I think actually the people want a multi-purpose palette if they can't buy everything at one time. This is one exactly. of those type of palettes you can really recommend. Exactly. And it just makes a lot of sense, right? Because they can easily do that. And I mean, Jackie knows. I, I will find no matter what, like we've forgotten sculpting, uh compacts before and things and i'll tell her like just give me some brown eyeshadow and yeah, i know one I'll one hit. time you called me last minute and i didn't even have my kit and she's like can you be here in an hour and i was like uh i don't have my kit and she's like it's okay just come over use whatever <laughs> i have i was like she's like it's not the makeup it's you <laughs> i was like i love you <laughs> but you can do that and you know you could take some of that if you didn't have if you needed a little brow powder Right. Um, but I love the second color in this palette for also for like if you take your fluffy brush, like now that we're just kind of playing on our five minute timers up, Jackie knows that I'm the type who will take that color and put it right here. Yep. And I'll take my exactly. fluffy brush and put it and just give my eye some life now, some depth. Yeah, you're making it bigger. You're you're giving it some some brightness. Right. And I'll just open it up with that color, but that's the same color I'll use for a exactly. contour. Exactly. And that's the beauty of this palette because I love the, it has the mattes, it has the four mattes, and then it has the four shimmers. Look good. You look so good. I'm so proud of you. Okay. <laughs> I'm Especially so your five minute makeup, makeup though. <laughs> Especially I had to blow my own hair today. I was having all types of stressful moments. Jira was like, how can I help you? Can I blow your hair for you? I was like, that's not going to help me. <laughs> You're not going to be able to help me. I'm going to have to figure out how to do this myself. Because when you have such long hair and yeah, it's really yeah. people always like, oh, you wear extensions. I'm like, no, no, no. This is all my hair. Yeah. It's a lot of hair to get through. Yeah, that's true. The struggle, struggle was real. It looks good. It looks good. But I will tell you guys a tip. Use that thick serum on your hair when you oh, come yeah. out of the shower. Mm -hmm. It's so good oh, for not... Yeah making your hair frizzy because the weather's so rainy in Boston where I'm at right now. And when you put it in your hair, it really does take up the frizz because I have, you know, really thick hair. So it can be frizzy if that's not blown. Mm -hmm. And I put it in and I was worried I'm never going to be able to, I'm just going to put my hair in a ponytail. And it really worked out. That's a good product. Needle free before your makeup. Highly recommend it. Mm -hmm. Highly recommend that one. And everybody knows this is good for a long time. And then I'll never leave the house without Oh yeah. Don't oh, yeah. forget to set set it, right? Set it and let it be. So I'll never leave the house. Jackie knows that spring a hundred times. Um and JR knows that too, but yeah. you know, I, I think he knows that. But my point is is that you can see how easy it is to do things and how you don't have to be a makeup artist to do this and how you can have these um share these experiences with your customers and with your friends and people yeah. you you know, are sharing the products with. And, and like, you know, uh, Sabrina was telling me yesterday, we have so many people writing us right now, asking us how they can be involved. And they're not anybody's UFO yet. They're just watching us on Facebook. And so all those new customers That's are awesome. being given out to the field, which is great. Yeah. 
And this is a great example of what you can do with your clients and your friends because everyone mm -hmm. in the comments is saying how much fun this is. So you can all do this. Just take, take action with what you learn, plan an event, have everybody come on and show them these tips with just this one palette. So much fun. Oh, honey, look, I did my own makeup by myself. <laughs> You always did the makeup. No, I did it by myself. <laughs> I love it. You like it? Yeah, I love it. Say hi to everybody. Hi, everybody. We wow, have a lot got... of JR. Hi, JR. Hi, JR. Yeah. Everybody just did a five minute challenge. So, Jackie walked us through the five minute glam, and everybody did it together. And we all hit it and had some extra 40 seconds left. So everybody did their makeup on their own. So we can show people it doesn't, you don't have to be a makeup artist. You have different to do glam models. exercises, huh? Yeah, well, you just, you don't have to be a makeup artist to do this business. That's right. And exactly. People are, people are always looking for a way to make money, especially in today's day and time. And this is a great opportunity for people who are stuck at home, who can actually have a lot of fun building a business. And if you show somebody how, how to do the makeup, Really any of those exercises, then they want to use the color and the application that you used on them. I told See, you that many. I was going to say, I, I just started laughing in my <laughs> mind because I have to, one day, maybe at the next event, we'll have to show JR's video of when JR gave me a makeover with motives on stage. Yeah. Oh my gosh. Yeah. So I want to see. He's so good at makeup. And he always says, do you want me to help you do it? Because he knows I can't see. A person I like, love oh, that. <laughs> but he is really actually good at makeup. I won't tell him about the time that you did color my hair. <laughs> Elvira. He colored oh my hair. My God. I mean, I was like 17 years old and my mother wanted to kill him because I came home with, you know, my hair is naturally blondish brown, but a lot more blonde, believe it or not. And I came home with black hair. My mother oh my wanted gosh. to kill him. Yeah, that's because we tried the Madonna Platinum first. Well, first you failed work. at that. <laughs> <laughs> and after I came home with this very black, black hair, my mother's like, she should be just done. <laughs> so Funny. We figured, then, we, then we figured out how to um, make it like, uh, what was the girl's name from the Wheel of Fortune? He liked her hair color. Vanna. Vanna. Vanna White. Vanna White. Yeah. He did it like Vanna White. White. And then my mother said, you know what? I think you should go to a salon and stop letting your boyfriend do yeah, your well, hair. We know a lot, but we tried a lot. <laughs> we tried a lot together. So the point is we've done a lot, but I've graduated from without him. Yeah, Bye, honey. <laughs> but um, but uh, we're having, that. that is what we're doing, Jerry. We're having a lot of fun, of course. And that's what I think all of these are about. You know, I want to talk to you guys now that you don't have anywhere to go. Well, maybe some of you get to go out tonight. Uh, I don't because we mm -hmm. Jared, are still stuck at home living under these COVID rules, but, um, and trying to still protect ourselves. Of, and by the way, you should too. The numbers are climbing um, and we have to be, be conscious and aware of it. And uh, I think, you know, this last week it really hit home for us as some of our family members became infected with COVID. And yeah. so uh, now it's an eye opener for all of us that it's really happening again. Um, and so you have to be conscious of it, but here's the good news. You get to have fun with us on Monday nights. You get to do the 28 day challenge with us every night. I do it every night. Um, you know, take my photo some days I'll post every other day. I at least post every other day. Um, because I really want you guys to see real results. And I see Kitty doing that. I see so many of you doing that. And I think it's so important for you to like follow some of these people like Kitty who's doing it every night. It's pretty amazing because you really get to see the transformation of people along the way. And I think what's happening is, is that we're seeing people's face transform long before 28 days, right? So I think I'm on day, uh, I don't know, eight or 10 or something. I've lost track of my days, but I've been super consistent. And the key is a couple of things. One is consistency. So you can, we've talked about this before. You can say that you have good skincare uh, regimen, but may, basically you're washing your face at night. That's not good enough. Not, um, not when you really hit 20 and up because you really should be focused on sunscreen. You should be fo focusing on taking care of your skin. So consistency is key in 28 days to make a habit, right? So once right. you get it done and you see those results, it feels so good when you really see the results happen. And for me, I really always take photos now, being very conscious of those 28 days, taking photos before and after. And you really get amazed. You're like, wow, I can see it. Right. And I especially follow people like Kitty doing it every night. I always go to her page to see what she's doing because I think it's so cool 
when you actually see the transformation on others. And um, I can't remember whose husband it was that was out there where she was doing her husband who had just turned 90 and he got, she said the new 90 is 70 and he looks so good. I love him. I've met him before. I think Corinne, are you on? Yeah, Corinne, I spoke to her today for a little bit on the phone. Yeah. Is Corinne on with us? I see, I saw her earlier as an attendee. Let's see if she's still with us. Maybe we can- Well, anyway, Corinne, I was so blown away. I, I remember meeting him in person and I remember thinking how much I loved him then, but I was so blown away how he was doing the 28 day challenge with us. And then JR said, can you just do this rolling thing on me tonight? Because you used to do it on me. Now you don't do it on me. You just do it on yourself. But the point is, you can really have fun doing it. And I think people, one thing for sure I've seen is that people have really seen the results of rolling yeah. and how important it is for the skin and really, you know, working the lymphatic, you know, getting the system moving is so critical for keeping our skin young and fighting gravity. So I just think that um, keep sharing your photos, keep sharing your videos. It's inspiring not only to me, but to so many other people. Now, every night I never go to bed. You know, sometimes I'll post my photo at 12, 30, one o'clock, two o'clock, because it depends what time I settle down, which for me is very late. Um, but uh, tonight I'll probably do a video live later. But my point is, is that the more you do, the more you're inspiring other people to see the difference between somebody who does something and somebody who's really consistent with something. And uh, you guys have gotten so good at it and it's so impressive. And Kitty, what do you think so far? Kitty, you've been doing so great. Oh, thank you, Laura. You have no idea how excited I am um, to be part of this. I am really, it is only day five, you see. I am. Um, have already sensed a huge difference in, in the complexion, in the texture and softer. Even my husband realized it, like he, he's very oblivious normally, right? <laughs> he's now, ooh. No, most, of them, most of them. Yes, so I love it. Thank you, Lauren. And I well, you're doing, you know, you're doing a great job. On that, Lauren, um, I think a lot of people are mastering like at least the essentials of, you know, cleanse, tone, moisturize. And that sort of leads into our segment for next week, which is going to be doing face masks together. So we're going to encourage you to sort of do those first couple steps on your own, wash your face, because that's going to be hard to do in a camera. But we're going to walk you through some targeted treatment products that we'll do together, and then we'll use a mask. So Lee, I don't know if you want to sort of, I know you were organizing all that and let people know what to expect for next week. Yeah, so we do have a landing page already set up and um, Sarah can actually share that in the chat for you all. So just pick your three step regimen based on your skin type. We've got a few for you to choose from and your three step is gonna be cleanse, tone and moisturize. But come next week with your skin cleansed and toned and then we're gonna go over three targeted treatments. You can just choose one um, that you wanna use that night but if you're not sure, we will have Vina Hutchins on. She's a, a clinical esthetician and she's gonna share some um, tips about each of the actives that we're gonna talk about. One being needle-free serum, which I know is not only my favorite, but Lauren's favorite. And then she'll also talk about our retinol and our vitamin C. Mm -hmm. And then we'll all be doing our Lumiere to be intense moisture mask, which is another one of my favorites. And then grab either the, the pink quartz roller or the tiger's eye roller. And we're all going to roll our faces together with the mask on. We'll take that off and then we'll, we'll all put our moisturizer on. And we're all going to look like amazing for bed. But I, I am just, I have to piggyback on Lauren. Like I am so impressed with everybody's results that I have been seeing. Because like Lauren said, some people have been noticing results in just a few days. But people are watching that. So by you posting it on social media, I've been having people reach out to me. Can you help me with my skin? Mm -hmm. And that's what it's all about is just helping others and share what you learned. And even if they just incorporate those three steps and then add just one treatment product in, mm -hmm. just think of how many people you can change, you know, their, their skin with that. So mm -hmm. keep on going, keep on sharing, make sure to take Lauren, make sure to use our hashtag 28 days of skin. 
Um, yeah. So we can find you and, and share and we can share each other's results too, because my clients like to see like, what can it do on this person's skin or that person's skin, or they don't always just want to important. see you. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I think that's important because we all have different skin, right? So, you yeah. know, somebody says, oh, well, I don't like this about my skin. Well, we can all find lots of things we don't like about our skin. I think, you know, if we were all really honest with each other, you know, there's always something about, well, I wish this was different or I wish this was different. And the point is, is that you can really target and work on those areas. And, you know, I've really focused on adding the retinol and the vitamin C and the rolling every night. Uh, a few nights back, I added the pentaxel to my lips because I wanted them to feel plump. Um I've really worked the roller hard as I was telling the girls before we broadcasted tonight um, here because I get these two little lines here and I used to Botox them, but because I can't go to a doctor and Botox my eyes anymore, which is very frustrating during this time, I've really learned that I've been able to work it out with the roller and I don't have those lines that I was having before. Not to say that I wouldn't love to go back to the doctor, but it's really amazing what that roller does. And uh, it really makes such a big difference. That's why I always try to do the half and half and show everybody, which we'll do next week first. We'll work the half first and show you guys different techniques. And um, I asked my doctor on the phone the other day, I was like, hey, can you help me with these two lines? And he's like, yeah, work that roller you're doing every night on Facebook. I see you doing it. <laughs> he worked the roller really hard. And he was giving me tips to do it on the lips and underneath the lips and making sure I had enough vitamin C on my face to get that serum in because you really want to make it a smooth application. And so um, I feel like I have brand new skin without even having to go to the doctor. And I think for somebody who's already very focused on skincare my whole life and been blessed that had a mother before she passed away to be able to tell me how important taking care of your skin is um, and not being somebody who's exposed to the sun. Um, you know, I just stay away from the sun for many years, even since I'm a teenager, I wasn't one of those girls that I think it really does make a big difference. And I think, um, you know, doing those things for yourself is so critical, critical. And Corinne, I see you. I was so happy when I saw your husband, you know how much I love him. And I saw him doing the face roller the other night. And I was so impressed. And I was thinking to myself, I showed JR and we were almost in tears because he's just an inspiration. He's 90. He looks like he's 70. He's just got so, uh, God bless us. If we all, we should all look like him at 90. So I was so blown away with him joining the challenge. He us. loves it. The difference is amazing after just a few days. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Oh, his skin is so good. He told Kim Ashley today that he couldn't believe anything cold, that cold on his skin could do any good. It was so funny. Oh, uh, that's great. Well, well, Kim is, uh, I'm sure Kim loved it because oh, he's I'll, just been- <laughs> had a blast talking to you both. <laughs> He's Good. an inspiration, but I love seeing him on there. And I love that you share the photos. And I think it's an inspiration because I think, you know, so many men, I keep telling guys, you, you have to focus on skincare. You know, we have a tendency to think that um, because, you know, we're like, oh, well, men have it so easy. They don't have to put their makeup on. They don't have to get their hair done. But, you know, you want your man to look good. You yeah. know what I mean? I always say like, JR, you need to tighten it up. You know, we need to work that that face and work because when Jackie will tell you, I'm always working. Like he'll he'll be getting ready to go out on stage. I'm like, no, Jerry, you need to let them brush your hair. You need to give him a, let, let him put a little bit of powder on you so you don't sweat. I'm always pounding him because we should care, yeah. and they should care, and their yeah. skin is just as important as our skin. Absolutely. No, and I think you know, like everyone is saying, sharing these photos and videos is way more impactful than you think. And we get to see so many of them in the Facebook groups, but especially, but I encourage you guys to share that on your personal pages outside mm-hmm. of the Facebook groups, because that's when you're really going to get, I think, the most out of sharing your journey, because you have both the support from UFOs, beauty advisors, your clientele, you know, just random followers that you have. And I think if you start sharing that on your personal pages, using the hashtag 28 days of skin tagging Lauren, tagging Lumiere Divi, it's really going to get more eyes on that. And I will give you a little secret, which I didn't want to tell, but I think it's important for you guys to know because it might motivate you. So Lauren has been, you know, sending direct messages to some people that have been really active in 28 days of skin as a thank you for just participating. Because honestly, 
the results and how many people that have been joining has been astonishing. So continue sharing on your profiles, continue tagging Lauren because you never know, you may get a little something from her, but I think everything's been amazing and you guys are doing great. I just, you know, Sabrina and I have been really paying attention to what people are doing. Cause I think for me, um, I'm always ready for a challenge. You know, I'm, I'm not the type of person who can work without a challenge. Like mm -hmm. actually I challenged myself as soon as I, uh, before conference. And as soon as we came home from conference, I told Lee and Lisa before conference, Hey guys, I want to do a challenge if you remember. And, um, and then there you are. Hi, gorgeous. Yeah. Hi, how are you doing? You look great. <laughs> yeah. Put your head down so we can see. Yeah. <laughs> there you go. So, you look fantastic. I don't think you can see too well. I can see him perfectly. His skin has changed so much. He looks great. You His like skin the roller. has changed so much. You like the roller? Oh, yes. <laughs> the cold roller on your face, do you like it? I don't like the cold, but... The roller, roller's all right. <laughs> Look at that. He doesn't like the cold, but the roller's all right. Because I, I, I have it. it in the freezer. Me too. That's how I do it. But well, you know what we your... do every morning and every night? We do our faces together. We have dual sinks. And you should see him with these big hands, you know, <laughs> these big hands. He's doing this. <laughs> We're going to do a That's video. Awesome. I love that. That keep posting those photos, right? Mm -hmm. Love it. Keep posting those photos. It's important to be a product of the product. I think that's what's making this challenge even better. Is your customers want to see your results? You're going to sell more by showing them that it really works. Exactly. Yeah, I, think, I, can. I, I was going to say really, something. Go ahead. Go ahead. I was going to say something similar. Um, you know, a lot of you are posting in our skincare group or the motives group, which is awesome because we do want to share each other's before and afters, but make sure like Sabrina said, you're also putting it on your personal page so that mm -hmm. the whole goal is for you to get new customers and for you to empower people to look and feel better. And at the very least, maybe create, if you've not yet, like a VIP group for your own customers. Mm -hmm. And that way, whether it's you, you know, not feeling comfortable putting it on your personal page, you can put it in your VIP group. Um, but that's where your customers are going to feel comfortable posting a picture like I'm having here's my skin, like, tell me what I can do. And they may not want to have that conversation on your timeline where thousands of people see but if you invite them personally invite them just like you would to an in-person event you have to call them you know have a conversation hey i'm thinking of you thanks for liking my post i wanted to invite you to join me we're going to do it in this private intimate space and like we're committing to you monday nights maybe make something really consistent that you're available for um, a live Q and A with your customers, you know. So just there's so many ways to keep it engaging and interactive in a virtual world, and I think that's really important because it, we're not going back to normal anytime soon. Um, and even like once we do, people like me that stay home with three kids, like I can get so much more done leveraging technology. So we really have to marry the two and just learn to evolve, you know. Yeah, it's been great. The technology's been great, and I think um, just everybody understand that you know, obviously, like I said before, 28 day challenge is not necessarily um, just to have something to do. It's really because 28 days to make a habit, 28 days of consistency. If you're not consistent, you won't see the same result. Um, and people say, oh, I've tried that and it doesn't really work. It's, no, truth is most people are never consistent with anything. Um, for me, I'm all about a challenge. If, if I'm working on a project, I have to have a goal. I have to have a number. I'm not one of those people when we do a big meeting and Kim knows this at the office, when we do a big meeting, I'll say, what's the deadline? What's the goal date? And um, because you got to shoot for something, right? You can shoot for the moon. Maybe you'll hit the stars or vice versa. The point is you got to hit something. But if you're consistent and you stay with it for 28 days, then you'll stay with it from there on out because you'll have already seen the results. And that's what's important. So certainly, um, you know, always work on your inner soul. That's the most important thing you can do. And you can do that with this business, too. Um, but I think that we're able to help so many more people this way. And I want 
you know, that the reason I have an audience, and if you're wondering if you can be somebody who's on our audience next week, you can. Um, but we've just been picking, you know, 25 to 50 people each week. So we can have different faces on here. And we can interact and be live with you. So it's not just me and Lisa and Lee or Kim, um, but all of us together. Um, so we can interact and share experiences. And it's a lot more fun that way, right? And it's never too late to start. I know some people are saying, I, I just started the 28 challenge. You can start at any time. That's the beauty of it. So make a commitment and start next week. Order what you need and then join us next week. And we'll walk you through on each step how to do it if you're not sure. Invite your friends. The more, the merrier. Let's see how many people we can get on here because I have a lot of fun hanging out with you guys too. It is a lot of fun. And that's right, Lee. It doesn't matter when you start. We started the 28 days. Some people started a couple of days later. Some people are just starting tonight. That's okay. It's your 28 days. It's all about 28 days committing to the habit. Um, and then you'll see in the next week or two, we'll be introducing our next 28 day challenge for health and wellness that I'll be doing with Dr. Deidre, which is gonna be incredible where you'll be able to add a new product to your health regimen. And we'll go through a list of products with you and what they'll do so you can pick that. So, you know, your health is wealth as Andrew Weissman always says. Um, and it's true, right? So we'll kind of go through a list of products and you'll add something that maybe you've never used before and uh, be consistent with it. And when I say consistent, it's not every other day. It's not like I'll take off my makeup tonight, but I'll forget to do it tomorrow. No, I never forget. I always do it. I always do it no matter what. That's why we say it's Jared's like, can you just come to bed already? Every night he says the same thing for the last 30 years. The point is, no, I can't just come to bed until I do this for me. Right. And the results will make you happy. Um, and so that's the key. And the same thing with the health and wellness challenge. And then in December, we'll be launching the JR and Lauren business challenge, which we're going to be doing with you guys, which will be holding everybody accountable through a Facebook group that we're going to be starting and our weekly Zooms together, where we'll talk to you guys and hold you accountable and actually have you come on with the prospect, teach you how to show them the business, do it with you and hold each other accountable. So we're gonna do something we've never done before, but the 28 days really works and people are seeing a lot of success with it. So I'm taking baby steps with you guys, right? So if we can do baby steps together, we end up creating a long time, long-term habit that will really make a difference for our lives. I love that. I, I Maybe love one that. last plug for our booking event to event. We have our first battle of the brushes this Thursday. Um, so I know Lee's going to be participating. Melina's excited because uh, it's one of her partners, Roshante, who's a makeup artist out of Ohio. Um, so Lee, I'll let you share. But I felt like we should talk about that before we hop off because you all can join in on that Thursday and invite your customers to do the same. Yeah, that's so way to watch it. <laughs> me and Roshante are going to battle it out with the New Horizon palette. So we're going to be going live on Instagram at 3 o'clock Eastern Standard Time. And um, we're both going to be doing different looks with the same palette. And we want you guys to watch and let us know like whose look you like most or which one you're going to try. And then at the end, we want you to nominate who you'd like to see battle it out in our next Battle of the Brushes event. So it's going to be a lot of fun. That and I can't wait. I haven't even had time to really play with the palette yet. So I'm really excited to really use it and, and see what I can do with it. And if you guys don't, no, Vershante, she's actually been a beauty professional for quite some time too, is beautiful. And so I, I can't wait to see what she does with it. So it's going to be a lot of fun. Make sure to join us on Instagram. That's going to be fun. And I want to mention one other thing. So last week we did the uh, signature look, right? And this week we did the five minute look. And I've had Kim Ashley reaching out to Shondell, who's working on adjusting those colors for darker skin. <laughs> So we have a signature look and a five minute glam with some small adjustments and Jondelle will be helping her because she has such beautiful skin and she'll help mm -hmm. get us right 
so we can cover everybody's skin color because that's really important. We want everybody to be able to participate in that. And she was, uh, she's so beautiful, Shondell. And she's very focused on the 28 day challenge and sharing this stuff. And she has a great VIP group too. So I love uh, Sabrina and I watch her a lot. She's really heavily focused and I'm sure she's getting a lot of customers from this, but we mm -hmm. encourage you if you have a different uh, color skin tone that we're working than what I have, even though I actually, even though I'm light, I have a lot of yellow in my skin. So I pick a lot of warm colors, but if there's something that's not working for you, then I encourage you to reach out to us because we can always make adjustments and suggestions mm -hmm. to people because we want this to cover everybody. Yes. Any other questions, thoughts, ladies? Any of our panelists want to add anything? Well, I would love for everybody to take a picture I, of their I've been in Cambridge, North America, almost from the beginning. But then I had to find Kareem to help me do it. <laughs> he said he was, he's been in favor of Market America since the very beginning. He just wanted you all to know. No, oh, we love you. Thank you so much. <laughs> You're the best. I think you look like more like 60, not 70 or 80 or 90. She said you look more like 60 or 70. No, no, I'm a little <laughs> older than that. We look great. And there's Shondell, too. Hi, Hi Shondell. Yeah, I just promoted her to Hi, guys. Say hi. <laughs> so if you guys are following her, follow her and get some ideas of how to engage your customers because she is yeah, so Shondell is so, Shondell's so engaging. Shondell, can you hear me? I can hear you. I can hear you. I think she's so engaging. And Sabrina and I always go Thank and refer guys. to her page because even her Instagram and, and her Facebook, because she really does know how to engage with her customers. And she's like me. She's not afraid to show herself without makeup, with makeup, messed up makeup, perfect makeup. It doesn't matter. I think it's all now. about the real. <laughs> this is the end it's of the day the makeup realness. right now. <laughs> Yeah, but I think, uh, and I was telling everybody, you're going to help Kim and I get it straight so we can adjust our colors a little bit so we can cover everybody's skin tone during these segments, Absolutely. which is so important to me, and skin colors right. in, in these segments, because it's just so important that we can all do this together. Mm -hmm. Right. I agree. That's, that's going to be awesome. Yeah, I'm going to reach out to you. <laughs> how's your success going, Shondell, with the 28-day skin? So I, I'm going to say that one more time. I'm sorry. How's your success coming with the 28 day of skin? It's going really good. I've gotten a lot of requests for my VIP group and I've been doing a few sales. I've been doing a lot of one-on-ones and I'm seeing the hyperpigmentation in my own skin go away. So I'm happy about that. <laughs> yeah, she's, you, well, you're beautiful anyway, but me too. Uh, That's my you. struggle. As you know, I, I tell everybody my struggle is uh, pigmentation. And I think people mm -hmm. say, Oh, well, it comes from the sun. It doesn't for me, it's a genetic thing. Yeah, me too. And, uh, you know, your hormones can produce so much. And mm -hmm. so for me, it's always just an imbalance of hormones that I've had my whole life. And it's been a struggle forever. So yeah. I, I really think for me, the super cream has been uh, a miracle product, you know, and I always say that in the U.S., we never really um, took advantage of how powerful that product was. Um, mm -hmm. But it started flying out the door. Kim will tell you in Taiwan and we couldn't keep it in stock. And I was like, you know what? I'm going to try this. And so in Taiwan, they were telling me they were using it for their discolored spots, you know, and hyperpigmentation. And that's where I've had real success with this challenge, I think. Yeah, that's awesome. But I have been seeing a lot of changes in a lot of people. I, I watch everybody's page all the time and I'm just... It's so much fun just to engage with each other and build each other. So it's been fun. That's well, another great you. point, Shandell. And I saw Emile actually said that earlier when Sabrina was talking that we should do that for each other. Mm -hmm. It takes a second, not even like scroll, like, 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 and right. engage. And, you know, don't be weird, like, and be like, oh, can I steal this picture from my customers? But just say, oh my gosh, the transformation's amazing. Like, what's your ritual? Like, Engage mm -hmm. so that you're helping, you know, each other. It's it's important and it's easy to do. Yeah, yeah we do that a lot too. And I have a few ladies in my private VIP group as well. So like, if I post something, we share it. Like it's it's out there. It's free. So share it with with whoever. So that's what it's there for. And remember to tag me on your photos because Sabrina is always looking out for that for me because I want to share those photos of you guys. I think it's so inspiring to see people's before and afters and that. 
you know, that they're not afraid like I am to put those up there. It takes, you know, you got to be kind of brave to do it. You know, some days you're better than others and other days you're like, whoa, I had a long night, you know? And so I think it's important that, you know, you, we share these photos with people because it really does make a big difference. And so the 28 day challenge doesn't stop when this is over. Your 28 day challenge and your journey can begin tomorrow if you haven't started. That's the point. The point is to get on the 28 day challenge to start your journey. And then you can stay with us. We'll be doing, I, like I said, um, at the end of the month, I'll be introducing the health and wellness challenge that I'll be doing with Dr. Deidre and myself, who I love. And I think she's a genius. And we've really put together some amazing ideas to help you pick some new products and introduce those products into your health and wellness um, routine to really, again, be consistent and see a change. Mm -hmm. And so consistency is key, right? You know, if you're really consistent, taking your immune, taking your vitamins, then, you know, you can feel pretty good. But if you're not being consistent, um, well, now's the time to get on that. And then of course I get, again, I said in December, I'll be doing the 28 day business challenge with you guys, taking you from zero to executive coordinator, master coordinator, um, and really helping you grow your business with JR which will be holding you guys accountable, helping you, walking you through the techniques and really giving you something to look forward to that you feel comfortable doing, that you'll be doing it with us and we'll role play together. And it's something that he's, uh, it'll be taking the trial run method and the no decision close, but we'll be doing it in a different way with real role playing and people really seeing how to do it. And we'll do it together so you won't be afraid to do it anymore. Love that. And one more fun announcement that is coming up tomorrow. So our liquid lipsticks and our lip, liquid lip glazes are going to be launching tomorrow. So keep your eyes out. <laughs> Super excited for these. Yes, it's been a long time coming. So we're excited to finally get them out to you guys. So tomorrow's an exciting day. That's, That's great. Awesome. Well, everybody looks beautiful. Now make take advantage of doing a Facebook Live, telling everybody to watch you, join you in your 28-day skin journey, invite your customers to next Monday's uh, session that I do with you guys next Monday, which is the 19th, right? Yes. On my grandson's birthday. Yeah. So we're going to do that on Adrian's birthday. What's yeah. that, hun? Next week, we're doing it at 9 p.m. so that, you know, we're winding down for bedtime. So make sure like the team said, you're cleansed, you're toned and ready to learn a ton about skincare. That's great. Right. Thank you, Lauren, for having me do the five minute. And Becky, was, you're awesome. You know how much I love you. And I think everybody I really appreciates you taking the time yeah. to do this. Thank you, you so much. Well, oh, you're <laughs> welcome. No, I love seeing you guys do it with me or just watch us. Like it's it's really fulfilling. So thank you so much. It is. Thank you, you guys are all awesome. That thank is? you so much, Lauren. My husband enjoyed that so much. No, oh, you're you welcome. Made his it's night. Pleasure. Well, I want to thank all of you guys for joining us. And those of you who weren't afraid to go live with us and do it with us. It takes a lot of courage to do that. I want to thank all of you because you're also incredibly special. And I think it's just a way for us to be closer. It's just a way for me to connect with you guys. I feel like we all need to recharge our batteries. For me, after conference, I realized uh, how much I missed the connection of touching and human touch. It's really important to me because... Um, you know, my grandson has um, asthma. We're super conscious of COVID. And so because of that, none of us are really allowed to go out at all. And so we're really living in a lockdown world. And as I mentioned earlier, some of my family members this week were diagnosed with COVID. Um, and so we're we're really being super conscious about it um, at, at the home office. So we're just begging you guys to be super cautious and careful and take care of each other. Take your vitamins, take extra immune, take the extra C, take the vitamin D, do the things that'll make a difference to protect you and your health right now. Um, you know, don't take it lightly. This thing is coming around again. And mm -hmm. I think it's really important that we stay focused and do what's safe. And as long as we can connect like this, and I feel like I have you and we have human touch here and I feel much better. Yeah. Yeah. Great. Great. Well, thanks. I love you guys. Thank you. Love you. Thank you.